Hey guys, welcome back to our day. <laughs> I was gonna do this like perfect little montage, getting up, getting dressed, and going to the mall with Kaylee to go and look for homecoming dresses with her friend, and yeah, and then reality hit. Let me show you. Three baskets of laundry. That's actually two different loads. There's whites that need to go in with this one. Those are kids' clothes. I've got more down here on the floor. But the nice thing is that everyone is very motivated this morning. And the younger kids are staying here with Abby. And they get to watch Ugly Dolls today while we're gone. We watched Aladdin last night. It was super good. And um, so they're all very motivated. They're getting their chores done. They're not so far, they're not arguing. But I gotta like knock on wood. There's wood right here. <laughs> um, they're getting their chores done. They're bringing me their laundry. They're getting dressed. They're arguing now, but they're arguing over music. So I'm gonna have to turn this off because they are motivated by music, which I can't have you guys hear because then I'll get a copyright. So I am gonna finish getting laundry in and we have an hour until our ride is taking us to the mall. And let's just pray we can find a cheap dress for Kaylee to go to homecoming with. In case you're new, she is 14, in high school for the first time, and you're experimenting with her going to dances with just girls. She can dance with boys, but she cannot go on a date. So, this is all new territory. Ooh, I saw fruit fly. You guys, I hate the fall and, and fruit flies. I've got my little, oh, they're turning up the music. I gotta hurry. I got my little jar of apple cider vinegar and fruit and soap. And the soap, when it gets on the fruit flies' wings, kills them. Like, it, they can't fly. If they can't fly, they die and suffocate in the water. <laughs> okay, I gotta turn this off. They have music that motivates them, so we'll be back when we're ready to go. all ready to go. I'm gonna go double check everyone's chore level. See where we're at. They're doing really good. So let's see where we're at here. All right your room looks really good. Oh someone stole a pillow. You are not taking <laughs> Guess what? It looks really cute on your bed. Go ahead. Yeah put it on there. Put it on. And she had a bloody ear last night huh? So we had to wash the other pillowcase. Yeah, the was blank. Yeah, that's okay. We'll get it all washed up. Okay, what's next, Ashley? Save me. Uh, you're wearing pajamas. Yeah. Mom. So let's get your clothes. Mom, disgusting. You <laughs> farted. I did not. Yes, you did. I can smell it. No way. That is outside. I can smell it. It is not. Any Why are you in there? I don't know. <laughs> Do you want me to ta tell them what you just asked me to do, or is that too embarrassing? What? No. 
You know what I'm gonna oh, say? I want it, I want all it. right, but Chelsea's bed is all done up. It's all smooth. Um, this is this can't happen right here. I know. I'll pay for it. Do not put any stickers in your room. Why? Because I just paid money to have this bed made nice, mm -hmm. and <laughs> stickers don't come off all the time. You gotta take it off because. Okay. Oh. All right. So Chelsea's bed is all done. Is the playroom all done? I don't know. Exactly, yes. So. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Come and show me. All right. So the playroom is clean. Clean because they're still gonna play in here. They yeah. still have their American Girl doll community set up over there. And then you got your Hatchimals out recently, right? Yes. You've been playing with those. Made a little house for them. And now I'm gonna do something. Don't come in here. Okay, you're getting dressed. Yeah. All right, Ashley, you go get dressed, and we'll go check on Kaylee and Abby's room. Okay? Go get dressed. All right, and here's Kaylee and Abby's room. Cleanest it's been in a really long time. In at least like months. A certain side. <laughs> Let's just be honest. They did a really good job in here. Kaylee got all her blankets stacked up there. She could. They both could use new bedding, but we'll find. We're kind of on the hunt for the right one. Abby's room. Her side always looks really good. Actually, they have like cute little affirmations up here on the wall that they've been adding and pictures and whatnot. It's really cute. And this always looks cute. cute. Abby kind of makes that look pretty. Go get <laughs> dressed. <laughs> go. Go get, go get dressed. No. You won't be able to go play or hang out with Abby or watch Ugly Dolls if you don't get dressed. And I'm leaving in 20 minutes. 20? Yes. Go get dressed. It's not going to take long. Go get dressed. I can't. Yes, you can. She's not even in that room anymore. Go. Are you filming? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to sneeze. All right, so their dress has shown up for the wedding. I said, I said for mine. This is Abby's. So then, let's see. This is probably yours, Chelsea. Oh, that's nice. I don't have mine yet. Yeah, I'm expecting mine today too. They're all from the same company on Amazon, but we didn't plan it that way. Then mine is yeah, maybe coming shirt. Oh, actually, matches my shirt. I know it does. Here. <laughs> I could just wear the bottom. Here, you gotta make sure these fit so that you you have to reorder them. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, little bit big. Yeah, they're not gonna fit. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my feet. They're like entirely covered. I need to get you a I have a dress oh, like that. Oh, that was so weird. I need to get you a long one. No, this can't be you. Is this yours or is this Kaylee? That, Kaylee's. That's sort of. Uh, it seems like Kaylee's. I'm really. Okay, take it off. All right, so here's Abby's dress. Abby, come here. She's trying to take a look at it. Obviously, she's not going to wear pants and socks, and we're going to get a non see through <laughs> factor going on. But it's really cute, isn't it? That's a really good color on you. Mm -hmm. So that worked out good. All right, we've had like a really busy morning, but we're getting a lot accomplished. I'm putting my shoes on really quick. Kaylee, you ready to go? Girls, are you gonna go find a friend or watch a movie? Friend. Or play? I'm trying to figure out what they're gonna do. Well, we're gone. All right, Ashley, do you wanna play with Hatchimals? No answer. All right. So I will take you guys along with us to the mall and shopping for Kaylee. Trying to convince see anything her. cute? Just like so. Any of the? Okay. I'm not sure what you're asking to get. Yeah, just like anything that you see that I might like. <laughs> just like the, we yeah. counted while she's standing right there. 100 T-shirts in her closet. Mm -mm. Maybe 10 she's worn. I've worn a lot. Sometimes <laughs> I wear more. So I've started, when I gather the laundry, I take away clothes that she wears all the time. Yeah, and I get them back. So speaking of which, you get to take these ones back because you don't wear these ones over too much. Go hang them back up. And just so you know, I didn't like buy her 100 shirts like all at once. Obviously That's they're obviously hand-me-downs. Sorry, my shoe strap is not done up. Um, 
I used to work at Gymboree. If you are new and haven't heard that before, I worked at Gymboree for seven years. I just did it as a night job while I helped feed the kids. You know, I just, it just supplemented our income and that kind of thing. But it also gave me a massive discount on clothes, which was almost worth, actually it was worth more than my paycheck. So I would buy Jim Bree shirts, which if you know that brand, it's out of business now. Um, I would buy their shirts and sweaters and dresses and you name it at prices that were normally 36 to 45 dollars a piece and i would buy them for like two dollars three dollars my limit was five dollars a piece and so i would just watch for them to go on clearance a lot of the time what would happen is that customers would return something and we weren't necessarily putting that product back on the floor because it was an old style so that, and then i would ring it up and see what the sale price was and then I get my employee discount on top of that and I got myself a four dollar dress that's normally forty five dollars <laughs> so I over the years I stocked up on that kind of stuff and then hand it down and hand it down and then you get matching outfits for seasons and fall and back to school and that kind of thing and it builds up and builds up to the point where you have a hundred shirts for your nine-year-old so babbling Chelsea you're gonna go play Chelsea, you got to check in with Abby. Okay. okay, hang on. Wait. No, don't shut that door. Check in with Abby. All the time. Okay. Have fun. Love you. Love you. All right. So I'm just reading on Kaylee. We've got a few minutes here. And I obviously have another load of laundry. Oh, no, I don't. I thought I could move that load. I don't. I can't yet. So I still have one, two... And then I actually might wash our sheets when I get home from the mall. I don't want to undo the bed and pull it all apart if I don't have time. So I'm just waiting for Kaylee to get dressed. I'm waiting for you. You ready to go? You're, you're not going to want that sweatshirt on. Okay, let me go and convince her to change it. She's going to be changing clothes. She's going to get hot. Let me go and convince her to change her clothes. All right. You would think that we were just a few minutes from when we filmed last, but it has been four hours. <laughs> There's Kaylee. She is sick now. She has like a full blown cold, and we found nothing. And we went to all, or not Olive Garden, we went to Cheesecake Factory for lunch, which was fun. But we found no dresses, like nothing, not even an option. We went to Nordstrom's, Nordstrom Rack, Macy's to like specialty stores at Zara's, uh, went over to TJ Maxx. Where else would we go, Kaylee? I don't know. <laughs> but we found nothing, and so we're gonna order on Amazon. The two that we have in our cart are $25 each. So she's just making her decision now, and then she wants to take a bath. She just doesn't feel good. Well, they're upstairs in their bathroom playing last week the bathroom. Oh dear. What? What's wrong? Chelsea's in the bathroom playing last to leave the bathroom wins. <laughs> I think I'm going to go stop this game. This is why they can't watch some YouTube. I know. It's fine. That's why we don't play those games on this channel. So let me go and talk to my kids about playing in my bathroom. Oh, you made brownies. Uh, I forgot to add the eggs. So the <sighs> How did you forget to leave, add the eggs? Is it bad to not have eggs? Yeah, I just... Yeah, it's not gonna like rise. Oh, but it's just like rock hard. No. It just. Alright, well, let me go and figure my family out and we'll figure out what we're doing for the rest of the day. Um, Abby, Caitlin. I know. Oh, Aaron wants to play. Aaron. Caitlin's brother. Yeah. But Henry's here too, so they could totally go outside and play. I'll go tell him. Okay, hang on one second. They're playing last to leave the bathroom. Yeah. yeah I'm going to keep my camera on those that are in here, though. Why? Oh, my God. I know. This is going to make your water leave the bathroom. <laughs> it's 14, oh, wait, 15. I don't have to turn it off, so. Nope. Yeah, we know how to you turn it off. You can't touch them. Nope. Oh, go, go, go. No! <laughs> <laughs> okay, turn it 
try. Okay, we want you guys to go outside and play. Your friends are asking you to go out. Okay, pause the challenge. No. Just stop the challenge. All right, we're pulling the lazy card, huh? Yeah. Oh, your dress is like low. She was outside playing. Here, sit up. Sit up. She was outside playing and she got hurt by a branch, right? A stick that I picked with a stick. Oh, okay. <laughs> so then she decided to come in and hang out with me and we're gonna snuggle here on the couch. We got our blanket and a snack of crackers and my phone, right? So we're gonna snuggle and I have laundry still going so I'm just gonna get up Wait. every so often and move a load of laundry. <laughs> <laughs> so we're still getting some chores done. I need to go and get, I need to go to Costco, but there's no way I'm going on a Saturday. Never. So I'm going to go get milk later when we turn our movies back in and that's it. That's it. I don't know what time is it. It's only like two o'clock. No, it's not. It's like three, oh. three twenty. Mm. Three. All right. Well, this is a good, I think we'll just enjoy a little bit of downtime for a second here together. All right, so I slept the afternoon away, which was wonderful. So a Saturday should be spent. I'll we'll probably do the same thing tomorrow. We are here with Jason. We are we going. Worked a long, hard day after two weeks of. You don't work. think it's hard to go with two teenage girls to go and look for dresses that you never find? Oh, and I would do that over helping <laughs> menopausal women find <laughs> shoes to fix their bunions any day. All right. We're going to dinner, Dad, watch out. but first of all, um, we are going to our friend's house. She's hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Bear. Come over here, Bear. We're at my friend's house, and her daughter is going to go serve a mission for our church, and so we're kind of having a farewell for her. Bear, come here. Anyway, so we're going to go say goodbye to her, and then we'll go to dinner. Two of our girls are at home, so... Oh, battery's flashing. We'll see you after dinner. So Chelsea has a lemon. You gonna eat it? We're not eating. Okay, go ahead. Can I try it? Put it in your mouth. Put it in your mouth. Say goodnight. Say goodnight.